Hi everyone, this is Swamp Rabbit, and today I'll be doing a walkthrough guide for the medium level of the Blimp My Crib Odyssey using Quincy as a hero and no monkey knowledge. My crew is going to consist of two boomerangs, two pirate ships, two wizards, two ninjas, four banana farms, two villages, one tax shooter, two snipers, two engineers, and one druid. So let's begin. Uh, for Scrapyard, I'll start with Quincy. And I'll place this on Auto Start. And next I'll go ahead and place a Sniper. I'll add full metal jacket to the sniper and I'll place it on strong. Then I'll add a tag shooter. Tax shooter, I want to upgrade it to one zero two. Then two zero two. Then two zero three. Next I'll add a banana farm and I'll upgrade the banana farm to 200. Zero Uh, then I'm going to add a village. And I'll add camo ability there.
I'll add a second banana form and upgrade it to 200. And then I'm going to add night vision goggles to the sniper and then shrapnel. to make an upgrade and I don't have enough money so I'm going to sell a banana farm to upgrade my tax shooter. Okay, when these guys get over here I'll go ahead and use Quincy's ability. Okay, um, I'll go ahead and add that second banana farm back and upgrade it to 200. And I'm going to upgrade to bigger radius and jungle drums, primary training, and then primary mentoring on the village. Next I'll upgrade to bouncing bullets on my sniper. I'll upgrade to large caliber on the sniper. Okay, and when these ceramics start getting here by Quincy, I'll use his ability. And on to island number two. Here I will start with my Quincy. I'll add a pirate ship. And I'll add grape shot to the pirate ship. Oh, and faster shooting.
and then double shot. Next, I am going to add a village. Make sure that the pirate ship is in range. And I want to add camo ability. I'll add hot shot to my pirate ship. On 27, I'll use Quincy's ability on the yellows. I'll upgrade to destroyer on the pirate ship. Next, I'll go ahead and add a tax shooter within range of the village, and I'm going to upgrade that to 203. And then 204. They'll upgrade to you primary mentoring on the village. And I'm 
going to add a druid and I'll upgrade to Druid of the Jungle. I'll also give it Hard Thorns and Heart of Thunder for its direct attacks. Upgrade to Jungle's Bounty. Then I'll upgrade to Aircraft Carrier. I'll go ahead and upgrade to the tag zone. And on to map number three. to begin with a Quincy. Let's see, I'll place him here. Next I'm going to place a pirate ship. a bit longer range. Grape shot. Let's see, next I want to add a boomerang. I'll 
that it's targeting on strong and give it longer range and then red hot range. Now I'll add a banana form. Now I'll upgrade this banana form to 200. Next I'll upgrade to Hotshot on the pirate ship. And then to Cannon Ship. And I'll add Camo ability to it. I'll add a second banana farm and upgrade it to 200. On round 27 on the yellow balloons, I'll use Quincy's ability. Yes. And I'll add my fourth banana farm and I'll upgrade it to 200. Upgrade the boomerang to glaive ricochet. And then I'll upgrade to Monkey Pirate. On 35, I will use the Pirate ability to pull in that Moab. Right, now I'm going to go ahead and add a second Pirate Ship. And I Grape Shop all the way up to Cannon Ship, and I'll give it Camo ability. Upgrade one banana farm to three two zero.
then I want to upgrade the second pirate ship to monkey pirates. On 40, we'll use both of our monkey pirate abilities. And then I'm going to upgrade banana farms to 320. Next, I think I'll add a Druid really quickly. I'll drop it down here and upgrade it to Druid of the Jungle and give it Heart of Thorns with Heart of Thunder. off of auto start. I did sell my farms and also my boomerang so that I can make that upgrade there to a uh, pirate lord. I want to get some farms back. <laughs> We're going to need some money. Place a village and give it camo. Okay, uh, then I'm going to place an engineer, larger service area, oversized nails pin, double guns. Okay, on the round 50, you want to pull in one of the Moabs, the first Moab, with your 042 pirate ship. And then you want to wait for one BFB and one Moab before you pull in the other two, before you pull in those two with the Pirate Lord. Go ahead and upgrade the second engineer to a Bloom Trap. And 
add some uh, banana farms back. two of these coming so we want to kind of wait Ooh, wrong one <laughs> use the fire record ability I'm going to kind of hold off and see if there's just going to be one or if we're going to have more than one. Ah, uh, see, there's another one. So then I'll use the Lord Pirate ability. Pull them both in at the same time. I'm actually going to move it back here even further. Uh, this one I'm going to move it back as well. to go ahead and add a 420 sniper. Now on this round, I do have it running slowly because there's so much going on. Uh, on this round, I am going to wait until there's enough of these exposed and then I am going to use the Lord Pirate ability to pull in three of them and then I'll use the regular uh, Monkey Pirate ability to pull in the fourth. Then I'm going to rely on this sniper to hold this in place long enough. I'll use my Quincy abilities. Oh, 
but what I want this sniper to do is to stall this long enough so that I've got abilities again. I'm going to go ahead and put the sniper onto strong. Uh, between 62 and 63, you want to sell your farms, your sniper, and your regular pirate ship. We'll go ahead and start buying some things back now. We'll get our sniper back. Uh, we'll upgrade it to 230. Oh, and we went, what we did, we upgraded our engineer. So our engineer is 025. So sell your banana farms, your regular pirate, and your sniper. Upgrade your engineer uh, to 025 and then rebuy a sniper at 230 and upgrade it to 240. selling on that one. This final map, Sunken Columns, was so frustrating to figure out how to do using Quincy with no monkey knowledge and these crazy uh, advanced Moabs that come at us. But uh, what we want to do is start with our Quincy. targeting and then when I get enough money I'll buy a second sniper and also place it on strong targeting.
want to upgrade it to 200. Now on the end of round 15, or towards the end, I'm going to need to use Quincy's ability to make sure that no balloons escape. Next I'm going to add a boomerang that I upgrade to 022 and that I put targeting on strong. Now add a second banana farm and upgrade it to 200. Next I'll add a tax shooter that I upgrade to 102. Now I'm going to give camo ability to one of the snipers, so I'll upgrade one of them to 010. Then I want to upgrade my second sniper to 100. Now I add a third banana farm that I upgrade to 200 as I get the money. As you get enough money, upgrade your boomerang to 023 and then to 024, keeping its targeting on strong. Next, add a wizard and then upgrade it to 012 and then 022. Now you want to take your sniper that's at uh, 100 and you want to upgrade it to 102 as money becomes available. You can now add 
add your fourth banana form and upgrade it to 200. Next, you want to upgrade your wizard to 032. Next, you want to add a second boomerang. You want to set its targeting on strong and upgrade it to 004 and then 024. Next, you want to go ahead and upgrade your tax shooter a little more to 203. I want to give camo ability to the boomerangs and to the tax shooter, so I add a village and upgrade it to 020. to upgrade one banana farm to 320. On round 44, I'm going to take the game off of auto start. Next, I'm going to upgrade the village to 120, and as I get the money, I'll upgrade it to 220. Now I'm able to upgrade two more banana farms to 320 so that we can start earning money faster. So that'll make a total of three banana farms at 320. After round 49, I have enough money, I am going to place a 204 ninja, and then I'm going to upgrade the village to 320. Nice. Next, I'll 
upgrade my tax shooter to 204 and then eventually I'll have enough money and make the upgrade to 205. Final monkey tower for this map is going to be an engineer, so I'll add an engineer and then I'm going to upgrade it to 023 and then to 024. I place the targeting of the engineer's trap at the kind of the point of that center top, you know, the center point of that top section. After round 69, I am going to sell all four of my banana farms and then use that money to upgrade my engineer to 025.
Island floor is complete. If you have any questions about any of the maps, just let me know. Uh, please be sure to specify which map so I know exactly what question you're asking. And I hope you found this helpful. As always, thanks for watching.